the uh, 1.37 a.m. this morning, the Sheriff's Office received the call of uh, the uh, unwanted subject at the residence here on Rutland Hall Road. A uh, short time later, a uh, second call came in that there was shots fired. Uh, patrols arrived on scene. Uh, did find uh, one subject was deceased. The uh, person of interest is still uh, at large. We are attempting to uh, run down some leads to see if we can uh, track them. Uh, let, let's talk a little bit about the victim. Uh, what can you tell us uh, about this victim, um, male victim? He's a male victim uh, in his 30s. In his 30s. Is this his home? That's uh, evidentiary at this time. Okay. So this came out as an unwanted subject. How, how long was it between the time when the first call came out of an unwanted subject to the call of shots fired? How about how long was that? It was within uh, 10 minutes. So within 10 minutes of a subject being said, unwanted subject, then you had the shots fired. Do we know who made the call? Because we're in a really remote area. Was the victim the only person home, or was someone else making phone calls, or was it the victim making the phone calls? No, there was uh, other people in the residence. Uh, the phone call was made from that residence. Is this a family situation here? Was a family home? Uh, how many people were in the house? That's, the that's still under investigation. Still under investigation. Uh, do you, can you tell us uh, the relationship between the caller and this victim? They are known to each other. They are, they are known to each other. Let's talk about the relationship between the victim and the person of interest. This uh, perhaps, uh, are we calling the person of interest who we think did the shooting? Again, we, uh, we are actively pursuing some leads. Uh, and uh, Mr. Matheny is a person of interest. What is the relationship between Mr. Matheny and the victim in this case? They are known to each other. But beyond that, we can't uh, tell or, or you're not releasing what they're Not at this time. Okay. Um, I heard shatter of a weapon recovered. Um, it went over, state police uh, made, I guess, some kind of uh, all-points bulletin to local uh, law enforcement. Can we confirm? We, that have, a re we have recovered a weapon uh, in the residence. What kind of weapon is it? Uh, we're not uh, disclosing that at this time. Can we talk about how many shots were fired, perhaps how many? Uh... Not at this time. Okay. Um, what is happening at the scene right now? What, what, what's, what's happening as far as the processing? Right now we do have our uh, evidence uh, technicians here. Uh, they will be uh, collecting evidence at the scene and uh, be waiting further investigation from the medical examiner's office and the district attorney's office. Mr. Mr. Matheny, um, do we have him yet? Or we're still looking for him? You're still looking for him? We are still actively pursuing some leads uh, to uh, Mr. Matheny's uh, whereabouts. Is there anything you'd like to tell the public about him? Is this something where uh, you're asking the public to help out if they see well, him? Certainly, if anybody sees uh, Mr. Matheny, they are asked to contact the Sheriff's Office at 788-1441. At this time, we do not believe that uh, the public is in any danger at all. What is the priority, would you say, if you can gauge the priority of finding Mr. Matheny right now? Are we talking about a casual search, or is this something where police agencies are actively seeking him? And if so, uh, whereabouts are we looking? Again, this is an, uh, we are actively pursuing leads to locate Mr. Matheny. Uh, we are being assisted right at this time by the New York State Police, the Watertown Police. Is there any understanding? Oh, you're, so you're being, so the Sheriff's Department is assisted by Watertown Police? Because, um, it, is, is it... Are we thinking he was a Watertown resident, or he is a Watertown resident, Mr. Matheny? Right now, we don't know. We, we do know that he did have an address in the city of Watertown, so uh, Watertown police are assisting along with the state police. And do we have an accurate age on him? In his uh, mid to late 20s. Mid to late 20s, but we don't have an, an exact uh, age on him right now. Not at this time. What may have caused this? Is there any early indication of what may have started uh, th this well, what happened here? Again, that is all under investigation at this time. Is there anything that you want to add for us that we should know about the investigation happening right now or what happened? No, there will be uh, further press release uh, given out at a later uh, point in time. Is uh, Mr. Matheny known to police in the sense that he's been arrested before um, and do authorities have a picture of him? Uh, he is known to police uh, and we do have a picture being circulated to police agencies at this time. How is he known? Has he been arrested before? He, uh, he's known to uh, a few of the officers. 
but we can't confirm whether or not he's been arrested. No, we cannot confirm. But... Uh, the police now have this picture. Is this a picture that you're going to be able to afford to us so people can be aware? At uh, a little bit later during the investigation, we will be uh, placing a picture with the media. Um, any descriptions you want to give out right now? For right us? now, he is a uh, white male, uh, brown hair, brown eyes, approximately five foot four, 140, 145 pounds. He does have a scar on his right cheek. Uh, is there a vehicle also that you're uh, searching for? We heard something about a white vehicle with a black stripe. I don't know if it has anything to do with this. Is that accurate? Does it have anything to do with this? Again, that was uh, early on in the investigation. At this time, we're not sure if that is part of the investigation. Okay. Um, the, 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 uh, you were, uh, I'm trying to think back now. You're investigating. Um, as part of the investigation, you're, you're looking into how many people were in the house. The people who were in the house, are they okay? Are there, were there any other injuries? No, it was just the one, uh, one subject that uh, is deceased at this time. Uh, we have several people at the sheriff's office uh, taking statements from them. Was this the person, the call, or the other person a man or a woman? Uh, we're not disclosing at this time. Okay, um, where is that person? We do have that person. Uh, the statement is being 